Well, Governor Rick Perry is promising two and a half million new jobs if he becomes president. He launched a new ad with that message in Iowa today, just 10 weeks away from that state's first in the nation vote. Political reporter Josh Hinkle has more. After months of odd jobs, Magdi Naffa ended up in this South Austin food court a year ago, opening Grill Haven. Really couldn't find suitable work for my background and experience. Business is good, but this isn't the answer for everyone. The job force has changed and geared more towards younger workers. So it's no wonder jobs are the top concern in next year's election. Any way they can to get out and make a, make a dollar nowadays. In Texas, we've created over one million new jobs. Rick Perry campaigns as America's jobs governor, promising in his new ad to enhance the energy workforce if he becomes president. And reduce our reliance on oil from countries that hate America. But opponents like Mitt Romney quickly point out 27 other states have lower unemployment than Texas right now. In the last year, Texas unemployment has gone from 8.2 percent all the way up to 8.5 percent, while the nation's unemployment has gone from 9.6 percent down to 9.1 percent. Perry says his plan would create two and a half million jobs and bringing the nation's unemployment all the way down to 7.5 percent over the next decade. Slashing the cost of government cutting taxes for the middle class families, balancing our budget and growing our economy. As Perry's economic plan unfolds, NAFA suggests people without jobs hold out hope. That slate flats. And learn a lesson from him. Try to find something else until something else becomes available. In South Austin, Josh Hinkle, KXAN News. Now there are new resources to help you find a job in Texas. So you go to this story at KXAN.com. We've got a link for you to the Texas Workforce Commission and its new job matching website so you can search for the job that fits your skill set.